Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is Miss Tari and the voice behind Tari Gel. And today I'm going to show you how I tried to create my extra long nails. Now the first thing you're going to need is your base coat because if you do not have base coat, your poly gel or your nail extension gel will not be sticking to the surface. So I showed you my brand of base coat that I do have on my website available for sale at www.tarigel.com. Now we're going to start by applying that onto the tips and then once that's done we are going to put that in the lamp to cure for 60 seconds and then we will start with our design or our nail extension gel application So here we are putting our nails under the lamp for 60 seconds. I am using a 48 watt lamp. That is the best lamp to use to cure either your nail extension gel or your base coat. Here we are now, but now that it's um, all cured, we're gonna take out our clear and we're gonna apply that. Now I was going for an army design and I didn't have army green, so I had the bright idea. Hey, let's apply clear nail extension gel. I'm gonna apply the green nail polish that I have on, add matte top coat, and then apply my design and let me know what you think. How do you think it came out? Now I must say, one of the things that I love about nail extension gel is that it is so forgiving, it is easy to fix your mistakes, and it does not dry until you put it under the lamp. Now one bad thing is that it doesn't dry until you put it under the lamp. So I would suggest that you do probably like two or three nails at a time and probably do like a flash cure that way you don't end up messing up your design because i can honestly tell you a few times i've been applying my nail extension gel and i'm moving on i'm almost finished applying everything to all the fingers and then oop i hit one of the nails or my hand touches one of the nails and kind of smears it a little bit then you gotta go back in and fix it so along the way it's okay to do like a little flash cure for like 30 seconds just so that you know things are not moving around or getting messed up as you're going along and then once everything is all applied you can do a proper cure now for the 60 seconds now as you can see or it might look like i'm mainly dragging my nail extension gel but what i really do is pat 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 and then drag where necessary just slightly though because you don't want to end up pulling too much down so hopefully you can see what I'm doing and uh, get the hang of it this way because I know that I'm not always the best at explaining things, but I can show you.
Now with nail extension gel, you can go as fast or as slow as you want to. And as long as you haven't cured your nails yet, you can easily go back in and fix any little imperfections that you see. Or you can always just, you know, file it down a bit and try to fix any issues that you have. Now, as we can see, we did the first nail, so I didn't want to have it in slow-mo for you to watch me doing the other nails. So I did speed up that process. And then... Um, I did end up doing a little flash cure because I was scared that I would mess up anything along the way. And then I finished that up. Now, sadly, I did not record when I was painting the nails and applying the matte top coat. So all you're gonna see is the finished products. Cause I just showed the part where the green is on there and then the, the matte top coat and then the finished product so my apologies for that next time i'll try to remember to film everything or i'll try to snap more photos along the way but hopefully me explaining it or telling you what i did can um, assist you in recreating this look if you're interested and then for the lines i'm gonna be honest with the design all i did was i just placed the black white and this creamish looking color randomly or Kind of just around each each little pattern to kind of simulate the patterns that you'd normally see on the military outfit so that's how i achieved that look if you made it this far into the end of the video please leave us a green heart in the comment section now on the practice hand what i did was i applied the matte top coat onto the practice hand and then on that uh I keep forgetting what these things are called from time to time. The nail decal or we'll just call it the nail decal. And that one I applied the um, shiny top coat. So I'm still deciding which one I want to do for my natural nail. So thank you so much for watching this video and see you next time. Bye.